Pagen just released its video agent. So this is a video agent where you enter a prompt, you can add a person, you can add different products. It's going to combine it all to make a video for you. So it's not like a video editor, but it does make really cool videos when you combine different assets. So let me show you the good, the bad, and the ugly of Heijin's video agent. To be clear, this is beta access that I'm showing you. And we have a little prompt box that looks like this. It says, hey, you can share a topic, an idea, instructions with the video agent to produce a full avatar video so we can upload files of different things different objects products people whatever we want we can choose how long we want it to be so we can say hey let's make this 60 seconds we can choose a vertical or a horizontal video and then there are some suggestions so we can have like a UGC ad so we can just give this prompt and we can modify it to what we like. We can have an explainer video. So let's create a 30 second explainer video that breaks down MCP servers. So it's easy to understand for anyone interested in AI and using an MCP server. Please use clear and confident tone. Now we can hit go and it is going to start building this video for us. It's going to add all the assets. It's going to add literally everything we need. So while this is building and it is going to take some time, let me show you some of the other examples of things that I have been able to create. Uh, actually, I say that there's one other quick thing. It gives you a list like this. So it gives you like your topic, audience, theme, video links, so on and so forth. You can read through it once you're saying like, okay, this looks awesome all good we can say proceed or we can say hey we want you to change this or change that so we are going to go uh, proceed and we can hit submit and now it's going to think it's going to go through like a series of steps it's going to figure out its background music background everything and it's going to come back with a video for us based off our topic and that is the hope and the dream. Sometimes it does error out. But anyway, let's go on. I want to show you some of the ones that have been gener... While we're waiting for this one to generate, and it's going to take some time, I want to show you some examples. So here I have a whole bunch of little clips and videos that I've uploaded. And we have this prompt here talking about different scenes. And you can see each scene has like specific things that we want it to say. But we didn't say, hey, use this video for this scene. It's able to figure it out. Hey, Jen's video agent is able to go through and figure this all out. It comes back with our little topic. We said proceed. And then it built this little video for us. Now we can see it here. We can hit play. Many shimmer oils have ingredients that aren't ideal for skin. If you had a clean French product that delivers. Introducing Next Sun Oil Gold SPF 30 for radiant sun protection. This oil offers SPF 30, golden shimmer, and no white cast. Crafted with natural ingredients like rice extract, rosemary, and vitamin E. Experience a little- So if you notice, it like matched the rice with the, the words that I wanted. So it looks pretty good. And you'll notice, I'm just gonna move myself over out of the way. We can see the script here. So we can say, hey, let's go through and modify the script. We don't like this part of the script or whatever we want. We can say, hey, there is no avatar right now. Let's use an avatar so we can upload a photo of someone. We can use some of their default avatar. So we can say, hey, we want to use her part of our video and she's going to be talking. She's going to be the avatar. I'm going to show you some examples of this in a second, but you can kind of see we can like modify every aspect of our video. Let me show you another example. So we have like this one here where we don't have any assets at all. So it's just a very simple prompt that says, hey, create a short educational explainer video for students designed like a school lesson. And it goes through, it tells it what we want the lesson to be about, the age range, and we again, we just hit proceed and now our video looks like this. Hi there, future scientists. Have you ever stopped to wonder about how plants actually manage to grow? Well, it's all thanks to a process called photosynthesis, making things with light. That's right. Plants use sunlight, water, and also carbon dioxide. So I love this. It created this little animation. You can see the sunlight, the water, the carbon dioxide. Uh, it's all going towards the plant. It's really cool. So it's able to make little videos like this. As we come back, you can see we're at 78%. So let's move on with another example or two of things I've created already. In this test here, I uploaded some cards and a picture of AI Dana. And I said, hey, I want something promoting classic playing cards to adults, highlighting how it helps them have fun when friends and family come over, right? Simple enough, proceed. You can see what it did. Honestly, this is one where it's not great because it doesn't use AI Dana the way that I thought it would. It doesn't have her talking about the playing cards like you just saw in the previous 
example. Instead, we got something that's like this. Guests coming over? No idea what to do. I've got the perfect solution. So it is her face at the start. Like, let me just go back. Let me do this again. Guests coming over? No idea what- Guests coming over, and it's her face going towards the camera. Um, but the rest of it's really good. What to do. I've got the perfect solution. Classic playing cards. Endless games. Endless fun. From intense strategy to silly laughs. Playing cards create unforgettable memories. Grab a deck and let the good times roll. So it's just like a whole little ad promoting playing cards. And I think it did a good job outside of super zoomed in Dana face. Imagine you have a delicious, perfectly round piece. Each of these equal pieces is called a half. We have our MCP server example done. Let's see what it looks like. We're gonna watch it for the first time together. Ever wonder how AI creates amazing content so fast? <laughs> Yeah, because it has an extra hand. That's why it's able to make it so quickly. You can see here, he has one hand in his pocket, another one out here, and he has one over here. So that's why AI is able to make content so quickly. Meet MCP servers, supercomputers working together in the cloud. They handle massive data, allowing AI to process media. I really love that. The little animations are really good. Ironically, the people are what needs work. Yeah, quickly. It's like a super-powered brain for AI, creating complex content. MCP servers offer speed, immense processing power, and accessibility. They are the backbone of creative AI, enabling faster innovation. With MCP servers, AI's future is faster, more powerful, and accessible. So, like I said, it looks good outside the person. The animations are pretty cool. I just want to show you something real quick. So if you select your avatar, you can re-render it with the avatar you want, which I'm going to show you. We can also click captions so we can like decide what caption style we want. So maybe we want this style here so we can do that as well. We can also hit edit in studio. So it's going to open up like a much more rich menu that we can like actually upload and modify. So you can see here what it looks like. So we can say, Hey, let's remove the background or let's adjust the corners or let's just kind of make her smaller. So she kind of fits. So you can kind of see her now. This is boom. Her face fits a little bit better now. Now, when we hit play, you can kind of see. Hi everyone how it's starting to look. So this little clip is rendered. We have to render the rest and we'll be back when we have AI Dana giving this talk about fractions. While we're waiting for this one to generate, let me show you another clip that we have here. This is about chess. So our prompt is like, hey, create an explainer video that breaks down chess and how to play. So it's easy to understand for anyone to learn how to play it. Use clear and confident tone. We gave it this like classic chessboard. So let's see if it can use it. Welcome to How to Play Chess, a beginner's guide. Chess is a timeless strategy game challenging your mind and strategic thinking. The chessboard is an 8x8 grid of 64 squares, alternating colors, forming the battlefield for your pieces. Each player begins with 16 pieces, a king, queen, two rooks, two knights, two bishops, and eight pawns. Understanding their roles is key. Pawns move one square forward. Okay, so it used my board to like advertise the start, but then it's going to basically pull its own data to make its own board to show you how to play rather than the one I put in. Capturing diagonally. On their first move, they can advance to square movement. Now let's explore the movements squares horizontally, <laughs> vertically achieved. Guild chess player. Practice regularly, analyze your it's not bad, like the little animations and stuff showing the pieces and how they move is pretty cool, but it doesn't use like my board that I had from the start. So it kind of said, hey, we're gonna use that to start, we're gonna show it off, but now we're going to use our, now we're gonna use our own board. I did some modifications, so we had to like crop her head a little bit to make this work. So this is AI Dana explaining fractions. Hi everyone, today, we're going on an exciting adventure to explore something super cool called fractions. Get ready to discover how we can share things fairly. Imagine you have a delicious, perfectly round pizza just for- Hold on, hold on, hold on. There's pizza coming out of our pizza. For you. It's one whole pizza, ready to be enjoyed. That's more than one whole pizza. Now, what if you want to share this yummy pizza with a friend? You'd cut it right down the middle, making two equal pieces. Each of these equal pieces is called a half. So, one half plus another half makes one whole pizza again. Next, let's look at a yummy chocolate bar full of perfectly defined squares. 
This is one whole chocolate bar. If you break this chocolate bar into three equal parts, each part is called a third. See how each the, the chocolate just came out of chocolate. Each piece is exactly the same size. And what if you have a crisp red apple and want to share it with three friends, making four equal pieces in total? Each of those four equal pieces is called a quarter. So for listen, I think the tech is really cool, but it still has some room for improvement for this to be like really useful and usable. But nonetheless, I think it's kind of cool. Like some of the animations are brilliant. And then some of it's like pizza coming out of pizza or chocolate just popping out of the knife. It's like, it feels so close, but it feels so far. I don't, I don't know. Let me know what your thoughts are in the comments below. This is Hey Gen Video Agent. It's not released yet. So this is like super early beta that I'm showing you and I hope I'm able to show you. I don't know if I was supposed to or not. Nonetheless, let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Leave a like on the video if you enjoyed this. It tells the algorithm you enjoyed this type of content. Don't forget to subscribe. I cover AI on a daily basis. Thanks for watching and I'll see you tomorrow with another AI video.